here in Seattle for the 5th Annual NACTO Designing Cities Conference. There are over 800 people here from 125 different cities, and the energy is just incredible. People are here to exchange ideas, to meet peers from other places, to be challenged and think differently, and to really be re-inspired to go home and do great projects in their own cities. So clearly, NACTO is the place to come to share new ideas, what works, what doesn't, and talk about how we bring this revolution to the streets of cities, not only in this country, but worldwide. And I think that the thing that is attractive about NACTO that we do best is set the table for people to do real peer-to-peer -peer learning um, and to go past the sort of 101 level on issues. NACTO is a great organization because I think it provides the resources so many of us need in our cities to make practical changes on the ground. It's exciting, it's fun, uh, we get to see projects on the street, we get to talk to people, so it really kind of reaffirms the work that we're doing. This is the organization that recognizes that transportation in cities is not highway engineering. Making places for people where it's safe to walk and bike and take transit and drive and have all this stuff to work together, that requires a completely different set of skills and ways of thinking about making cities. Having NACTO at the table, putting forth designs that take into account pedestrian, cyclist, transit is so helpful in those conversations in cities because we're leading the way in transportation. Look how far we've come in just five years. To look back five or six or seven years and see what a different place cities are in is really encouraging. One of the magical things that NACTO has done is create the kind of standards that allow great innovations in one city or a couple of cities to get replicated. That is the way we're going to change cities around the country and around the world. And this is one of those places, unlike any other, where you actually have the space and the time and the expertise of like-minded people that are actually delivering these kinds of changes on the ground. It's exciting for us because we help to, to sponsor the Transit Streets Design Guide and when that's just an idea, it's one thing, but then when you come here and you see hundreds of people that are actually putting it to use to make their cities better, it's a very gratifying thing. All of our works that we've produced in coordination with NACDO via the Better Bike Share Partnership have really been about improving access, accessibility, and really lowering barriers. So now, when you're coming in to talk to this community, we have all sorts of tools in our tool belt to help address really specific needs. For far too long, cities were cut-throughs. They lost their self-confidence. And NACTO provides that level of leadership, the level of documentation, to give cities the confidence to go forward and know that what they're doing is not only right, but it's signed off on by DOT, that it's being done in cities all over the United States. When you get outside of the bubble of your own city and you come to a place like this and you're able to look around and say, hey, we're doing some really great things. I'm really proud of the work I do and that you can take that momentum back to your job and have it sustain you for another year. Um, that is something that's intangible, but in my mind, priceless. 